What's up guys, here at the shop. I got these stock turbos. Came off of a E93. And uh, they got some leaks. Pretty crusty. Anyways, we're gonna be installing these uh, VTT center cartridges. I believe it's a stock upgrade, just different blades on it. And uh, we got the repair kit for the wastegate. So I'll run you through, it's pretty simple. Um, need a few tools, nothing major. Alright, so we've got the housing all by itself now. I got it separated from the uh, from the compressor side and the center cartridge. Uh, we'll do that later. Uh, the next thing, this wastegate here. We want to mark where it's at in the closed position. So right there, it's closed and I'm just gonna put a mark right there and I'm there that way we have a reference point and we put the new one back in so now we'll uh, I'm gonna grind off this weld that's on there and we'll go from there And then I've got something to pull out there, right there. Basically, put a socket, put this bolt through, pull it out from underneath with a nut. 
to pull out the sleeve here uh, I came up with this got a long bolt here socket that fits over this so that'll go there that goes through that put a nut on the end of that that's just as wide as that sleeve and then uh, it should pull right out. Socket, bolt, that, that second nut is just a spacer uh, so that it's not so long. Now I got the, the nut on that end. So as I turn this, sorry. It starts pulling the sleeve through. So that's how you do that. Pull it through. You can see it's in there. The old one. It came off fairly easy. We got the new uh, sleeve here. And uh, we'll just hammer that in. Make sure it's straight and then press it in if needed. Next step, we gotta take out the uh, center cartridge from the compressor housing. And to do that, you'll just need to squeeze uh, get something like this, squeeze it together, pop it out. We'll transfer it over that clip onto the new center cartridge. Got the housing cleaned up here, so we'll pop it in. And you don't have to worry about marking where, uh, what orientation it goes to because it's keyed. See, it's got that, it's got that mark right there, which lines up with that right there. Cool. So we got this. Get that clip back in place. It's all assembled. Spins good. Clamp is back on. So now uh, we're going to get these. Uh, Get these pins welded up on here. That's what we're gonna do now. Weld it on the uh, arm here. Close shut the, the little hole there. The push hard is connected. It's all assembled. Close this perfectly.
I will get them installed.